Hello and welcome back to my office. Um, if you're new here, my name is Nick and I am a reseller. I buy stuff, I sell it on the internet. That's what I do to earn a living. Um, I thought I'd make a quick video whilst I have all of this laid out here. Um, you may have seen in a haul video recently, we went to a, a jumble trail Thing. you know one of those where there's lots of houses all having uh, little jumble sales outside their house and we picked up a a little job lot of these Disney infinity figures uh, I paid five pounds for a, a big bundle of them and also I picked up a couple of uh, freebies from other stalls at the end of the day a lot of stalls were not really packing up but going inside and leaving the stalls there and saying free help yourself so we picked up a load of Skylanders figures and there were a few extras in so of these uh, Disney Infinity so there are some duplicates I've put everything together so my total investment in all of this is five pounds and I thought I'd share with you how I'm going to resell these there's not a great deal of value in most figures um, but if you can get them cheap enough, as you'll see in a minute, there is some there's some money in it. Now, I've done my research. I'm not I'm by no means an expert in this. You have to do your research. Um, but I'll give you a quick tip. So this was in there. This is a toy box takeover crystal. And that I will be looking to get 15 pounds free shipping. It should it should ship as a large letter, just about. So that, and they sell for that regularly, that will put us in profit on everything. So all of the figures that I'm gonna show you in a minute, how I've chosen to bundle those up, that's all gonna be profit after fees, etc. So I'll flip the view in a second, we'll go through my sort of thought process and on what I'm going to do with these um, there's also some damaged ones we'll talk about those and yeah just share with you what I hope to get on the rest of it okay so here they are these are all of the figures so as I just said my total investment is five pounds and mostly I'm going to do it in bundles um, apart from that as I just said so that's going to be that should put us in profit at 15 pound free shipping I've made some notes here I've already drafted all of these I'm just about to do the pictures so I've got some notes on what I hope to get back now the prices I'm going to quote are free shipping and I'm aiming at the top I will send out offers I may get some offers in the prices I'm going to quote are the top end of what I might get back on these chances are I'll get a little bit less so these two this is joy and anger from inside out um, they seem to do quite well I'm going to aim for 10 pounds free shipping on those as a pair uh, these are guardians of the galaxy uh, so we've got Ronan and Yondu and raccoon here uh, we've also got this little tile uh, which goes with this guy uh, which is which I think he's Ronan a um, little bit more value in those they seem a little bit more sought after I've still chosen to bundle uh, for ease and I'm gonna look for 15 free shipping on those now you can sell these individually and they do sell but these have to go as a packet you know they won't ship as a large letter so the postage is a consideration so for ease and speed I prefer to bundle these up so that's what I'm choosing but but these do sell individually if you want to break it down to that level oh and I nearly forgot this guy is missing his hammer so that reduces his value anyway um, so yeah bundling makes perfect sense so this lot at the back uh, see there's a duplicate there of anger um, I'm doing this as one big bundle now I mentioned before there were some damaged ones so here 
we have a little headless one there another headless one here uh, Tinkerbell is missing a wing uh, so these have been used and abused uh, no idea who that is there are little code numbers on the back that you can Google and find out very quickly um, what they are um, I'm not chucking these away because now if you don't know what Disney Infinity is uh, let me just explain it's a series of video games where you these figures have a little chip and you essentially kind of upload the figure into the game so you collect the figures but then they enhance your game you can basically import the figure into your game is that how it works <laughs> i've never played it um, so they're kind of interactive with the software and all you need is the chip that's in the base so these if you're going to buy these to use with the game that still has some value it still has the chip in there right so i've chosen to chuck those in kind of as a freebie with this bundle so in this bundle we've got um Elsa, there's Aladdin, Baymax, Ralph, Sully, Woody. Uh, he's from Zootropolis, so is the rabbit, Stitch, Mr. Incredible, and Jack Sparrow. So fairly bog standard figures, not with a great deal of value. They're not in the best condition as well. They're a little bit beat up. Um, so yeah, and that lot I'm going to aim for 25 with these included we'll see how we go i may well take an offer on that and come or come down but that's what we're going to list it at so over here we have a load of marvel um this again has some damage i think that's um hawkeye he's missing his bow it's snapped off here uh we've got hulk and um Ultron I think it is Captain America Iron Man Thor you get the idea so we're bundling that lot with this little Avengers little crystal and I'm going for 20 on that bundle and then Star Wars let's do some Star Wars so I've split these up into two bundles so these are all damaged again Yoda his lightsaber has snapped off. Uh, Darth Maul is quite a good figure. He has, he has a bit of value, but it's common. He's lost both sides of his double-ended lightsaber, so I'm chucking him in. Uh, Darth Vader's got a bit of a bit of a limp saber. <laughs> uh, Luke, yeah, same damage. And there's an Anakin there who's not too bad. Um, so that as a damaged lot. Um, I'm going to shoot for 15. I think that's pushing it. I'll probably send out offers on it or take offers. You know, I'm just happy to get rid of that as a bundle. I'll probably go as low as a tenner. You know, they have very little value. And in that condition, that really diminishes it. So the second uh, bundle, these are in better condition. Uh, with sabers, Oop, come here, Anakin. Uh, Vader with his saber, although it's been chewed at the end, not ideal. Yoda with his saber this time. Uh, this is a nice figure, it doesn't have much value at all, but it's just nice. Um, oh, what's her name? O o o Ashoka, is that Ashoka? <laughs> oh, hey dropped up there she is um yeah and a luke and a leia and a nice little death star crystal so i think uh what was i going to go with on those uh about 17 18 pounds uh which hopefully is achievable again none of these are particularly sought after or valuable they're really quite common but as a bundle yeah we should achieve that if not maybe take an offer at 14 15 it's fine remember once that sells we're in profit on everything so you know it's fine so the last little bundle we have here some more marvel bits now this should be spider-man all we've got is 
a bit of his foot. Um, so this set, if I had the Spider-Man, does sell really well. Uh, I've still got the Venom and the Green Goblin um, and the little crystal here. And I'm going to aim for 15 on that. Uh, with the Spider-Man, that would be a super easy sell. So we'll see. Again, chances are I'll take an offer or send an offer out. But that's what we're going to go for on that. So there you go. That is everything. I'm quite happy from my £5 initial investment. That puts us in profit. And then whatever we get back on these bundles is all good. So there you go. That's, that's how I'm choosing to do that. And, and I think we'll do quite well out of it. Again, most of these figures do not have much value. There are exceptions, um, but generally they're not worth a great deal. Hence, bundling them up, you know, makes sense to me. Now, I mentioned, um, I think I mentioned Skylanders figures. On that same jumble trail, we picked up a load of Skylanders. There was some in a big crate of tech stuff that I got for a fiver. And in that box there was Xbox One games, PS3 games, two Xbox One controllers. So the Skylanders figures that were in there really owe us nothing. And then we picked up a load of freebies as well. So I've also got this, which I have not really started to go through. And Skylanders, if you've tried selling them, you'll know, again, most don't have much value. But there are exceptions. Um, so I'm going to go through this. That's quite cool. Um, and see what the best way of selling these is. I would imagine I will do a few bundles uh, and job lots. There may be one or two figures in here that are something a little bit special. We shall see. So. Once I've done the photos for those, they're already drafted. Everything is ready to go. I'm just going to do the pictures quick whilst they're all set up as you just saw them. Get those running and then it will be onto this box. And yeah, I'll enjoy going through that and seeing what we've got. I will, as normal, link a video up here. Uh, I'll pick one from, from way back when. Uh, so if you haven't seen that, check that video out and I will see you again soon for another video. Bye for now.